Hi everybody, Dominic Esposito, your drill instructor. Welcome. One of the things I noticed lately was the concept of players having to shoot what I'm going to call a wide open shot. But both in both cases, I've come too close to the eight ball. Oh, that's way out of control. You see what can begin happening? You need to begin discovering for yourself Gosh, if I got in this situation, I'd be in some trouble. I don't really know what I would do. So I want you to put yourself into several positions, and this is one for sure. Here's another. Let's put the 12 ball here, and we're going to put just enough angle on this cue ball so that I really can't reverse spin with some heavy right. At best, I'm still only going to come out to here. I'm never going to be able to come back down. In a position like this, how are you going to get to this eight ball? Again, these are wide open flyer shots that if you haven't practiced, you're taking a wild wide open flyer shot. I want you to be able to recognize what speed control do you need to get these balls down to where you go. Here we are in another situation like this. Once again, always start with stun just to see what the cue ball reaction is going to be and determine if that's what you're looking for. Okay, look at the possibility of that. Okay, I see the angle of that might actually continue and come to here. That possibility could have worked. You want to continue working with this same concept, but you might decide you want to draw into this rail higher as I was saying before, if in fact your opponent has left you some obstacles on the table like this, now you have some very important consideration to do. But I want you to consider this as the second stage of this practice. I don't want you doing things like this, the natural roll. I'm talking about where the natural deflection of the cue ball has got to take you at least through 150 inches of the table, give or take, it's got to be completely flying around the table. But here's one of the kinds of shots that you really need to have in your arsenal. You need to be able to get into these really tough situations like this because this whole area over here was cluttered. This was like the only zone in here that was available I want you to start looking at how you have to shoot these long, wide open, traveling shots. And I want you to be able to take out your journal, take out a pad of paper and mark down, you know, five or six different directions. Work from the side pockets, work from the bottom corner pockets, and then have to get all the way back up and all the way back. And really, don't even be surprised if you might actually have to table, travel the table three times because you need to get the cue ball into the opposite side of the table. Okay, that's what I want you working on. If you want to write me and give me some of your results, and hey, thanks to some of you that like to send me the actual video of something you've learned to execute. I really do love getting that. I do respond to all of those so everybody knows. You aim straight, you shoot straight, you split the pockets, and that's the drill instructor way. And I want to thank you so much for letting me share this with you. God bless you. Bye-bye.